Hello, my name is Patrick. Some friends call me Paddy. I'm a person in the world. I play the bass guitar in a band called Sticky Fingers. Uh, we're from Sydney and we've been playing together for about nine years. How are you doing? Let's have fun together. It was a cold night on King Street in Newtown. I was thirsty and Beaker wanted to go home. We were friends from school, the two of us. And there was this haughty moldy dude busking outside the Cooper's Arms Hotel. And then we stopped to listen and that was Dylan. And yeah, we just kind of became friends. The music didn't come first, the friendship did. But that's kind of part of what made it what it is. I think people can see that. The ones who get down to it, get down to it because it's what it is. It's real. Uh, we do like a bit of uh, fusion funk reggae. But we're a bit jazzy, we're a bit crazy with our instruments. Like sometimes Beaker shuts his eyes and then like sometimes Dylan will drink a beer while, while he's playing. That like, we're pretty crazy cats like that. You know, we're, we're kind of cool, whatever. Forget about it. My first memory was sitting in the, in the window and watching the train tracks and when the trains would go past, I'd, I'd do like the honking symbol. And then like, this train finally did it and blasted me. And I was so excited, I went to run down the stairs to tell my parents, but I fell down the stairs and cracked my skull open. So it was like a mixture of a success and closely followed by, what a loser. I am a, a one and only child. Do you think I'm spoiled? I don't think I'm spoiled, I reckon I'm lucky. I'm definitely lucky, and I'm grateful for my luck. Give me some more shit, quick! Um, my favorite Chinese place, my favorite Chinese place is the Golden Century, but you have to go at 2 a.m. in the morning when all the Chinese gangsters go, so you can sort of feel like you're one of them, live the dream. Um, I've got a couple of favorite pubs. Uh, well, there's a stained glass window of my face in it at the Gladstone, so I've probably got to say that's my favorite pub. I definitely like the idea that hopefully in like a thousand years when Sydney's all in ruins, that building's still there and that stained glass window's still there. People are going to think that we were saints. Yeah. We filmed a couple of music videos there. We filmed uh, Outcast at Last upstairs, but it's almost unrecognisable as, as the Gladstone because we sort of mix it up so much. Um, and we also shot Our Town there. We like walk into the pub. In January last year, me and Beaker got to work building our very own studio, which was probably still the most honest hard work I've ever done in my life. But yeah, the space has done really well for us. We recorded our most recent album here. Um, both Dylan and I have like lived here on several occasions, which is pretty rank really, but it's time, tough times. Tough times in Sydney have called for it. I've always been very into film and I kind of really wanted to be, not kind of, I really wanted to be a director. And then just this path of the band kind of came up and that was just working. And it was working and we were laughing and it was fun. And next thing we had four wheels and five dudes and you know, the road was there to be conquered. And so that the whole film thing has just been on, on the backbone ever since. Where haven't we performed? Uh, all across Europe and the UK, North America, which includes Canada, um, Australia, of course, New Zealand, the list goes on. I remember when I used to walk to school in the morning, we'd always walk past the Enmore Theatre, and I used to always like look at that place as being like the, the be all and end all. It's been like being sort of, you know, close to 10 years on from that, and now we're kind of like selling out, you know, three nights in, in a row at that joint. I got a fair idea that like the, the child version of me looking at me right now would probably be like, yeah, he's cool, which is pretty cool. Well, hey everybody, my name is Patrick Cornwall. You know, if you catch me walking down the street or flying past in a taxi, you know, come and say what's up. Uh, let's have a beer or a cup of tea if you don't drink. All right, see ya.